All right, all right. I'll get it in here, get it in here. Yes, my name is Maurice the Crochet Massa. And today we're going to see something very, very uh, different because a lot of people have been asking me uh, to do something like this. Uh, we're going to be unlocking our extended dreads. And uh, please, I would like you to give me your attention so that you can see how all this is going to be. If it's your first time to be on this channel, please try to click on that red button and ring the bell you'll be the first person to watch all these videos so uh when it comes to extended dreads remember uh if you've been watching my videos uh, we always use the hair to go through that aside down up down and up like we always uh, the way we we lock so it's the same thing here like when you're going to try to unplay you just have to look at your hair you just have to look uh, and see where the hair is and this is what i'm trying to do here is i'm trying to unlock where the hair is so this is the hair that i'm removing but uh, this one you just do it after saying where your hair stops because uh, uh, these are the extended dreads and remember we always use them with um, extensions so e the extension sometimes um, ex uh, extensions always look different from the hair and uh, the way we always look uh, you can be seeing where the hair is passing so this is the same thing that you do to unlock you just keep on uh, removing the hair this way you understand so for uh, for that one I would like you to have the things below uh, when you're going to uh, remove uh, the extended reds one you should have this needle uh, you should have this needle because uh, it is it will work for you very very fast than having a tail comb yes uh, this needle will work for you very very fast and second you have to be with um a spray a moisturized spray uh, that is when you can mix uh, water and uh, any uh, and uh, oil uh, uh, other use detangler but you can just use uh, water and oil uh, you should have it there uh, hair like oil that um, uh, any hair polish I just mix it with uh, water so that uh, uh, you use it and another thing you should have uh, the sink comb the sink comb uh, you can also use it then plus the tail comb excuse me like all those ones help you when to unplay this and then after we do some other procedures as you're going to be seeing them below so uh, you can see how i keep on removing my hair because i am seeing it i'm saying it uh, the only difference is yeah with the extended dreads to those ones who have been watching all my videos i think you've been seeing how i played it like we always get the hair the real hair uh, after putting the extension it's what we just keep on locking the like, side up and side uh, up down up down if you try to watch those videos so that hair is the one that i use to uh is the one that i i remove because i be saying it and um uh i told you that this this needle helps you a lot uh, because you can see these dreads had spent uh it is a uh, one year and two weeks yes if you want to prove it you can go on my uh previous videos and see when i uploaded uh this person when i was plating hundreds yes it's so um uh, you can see how i'm removing it and she did uh a repair uh it was like uh five times yes she did repair five times it is six times you know why um sometimes that those people their hair grows uh, faster and maybe it's when you have full C yes your hair always try to be uh, it moves quickly so uh, what we always do when we are repairing we just try to um, let me try to show you here 
you, you can see how uh, the sum this is like uh, the the dust or even the oil that we always apply it is straight stuck here so you just try to comb it very very carefully uh, I'm using the tail comb is just because I'm um, uh, this side like a excuse me like I'm on that side where there's the hair is little uh, those uh, uh, those but the parts where you can use this comb it's the, on the sides yeah just the round side but you don't use it like here in the middle so try to look here very careful you can see I'm low I'm seeing my hair the way where it stops so I just cut down uh, when I'm done with that like where I see the hair stops I just cut down and then I try to uh, remove it this way after cutting down and already I'm seeing it here I can remove it just like that I told you that when you're using this needle is very very nice uh, now I get it you can see how it is then I just keep on moving uh, with it this way I keep on moving with it you can see just like that and um, uh, th that's just you can still use here the system like going up and then down like this sorry my camera is moving but I'm trying to get closer so that you can see what I'm doing and still up you see then down I'm using the other system of the way I always played so this one is also going to help you uh, to uh, remove this uh, extended dreads and trust me when you're removing the extended dreads uh, your hair comes back the way it was yes I pr trust me on that as long as you've been doing uh, repair with us because sometimes it's also very very uh, important uh, so like me I don't do repair to those dreads that I did do myself like if if they are natural I can do them I can do the repair but if it's with extension I do repair I don't do repair because sometimes our locking is not the same our locking is not the same yes that those ones who lock it differently so if you're trying to repair something um if you try to repair uh, uh, the, those dreads it will be difficult for you so you can see here the extension is here and my hair is here so what i can do i can just bring my scissor and remove this extension because it doesn't i don't need it anymore and then it simply files all my things like here Mm, but uh, you can see now this hair is in the middle. I did the other one first because I can't show you the whole head I did the other one first to show you how even the uh, the side hair is Growing and now we are in the middle. So here in the middle it, You can see it is It it, it is tangled you can see Yes, but so now here you just try to use your hands very slowly yes very slowly uh, just like that try to massage as you're removing it slowly by slowly yes here i don't use the other tail comb because uh, uh, here uh, the, the hair the volume of the hair here it's a lot if i try to use that comb that means i'm going to break the hair so i try to use my needle plus my hands as I'm removing this slowly by slowly you can see I'm doing yes you just try to massage yes just like that <laughs> the hair was dirty already excuse me the hair was dirty already and um, but that's how you do you see how I'm doing it I don't use the comb from the first uh, from the first verb uh, from the very first place I don't use it so after saying like I've detangled some with my hands just like that uh, just like that you see how I'm doing it yeah because here in the middle the hair is always a packed and so you can just uh, uh, bring the comb but you start combing it so when you're done with that you can see I'm done with that and then 
uh, when I get done with that is when I bring uh, the sink sink comb you understand you just bring the sink comb and you try to comb it yeah this is one is what you use here you understand this is what you use here to unplate these just like that so uh, when you're done with this step then you know the next step you're going to do is to add uh, the detangler and you just try to massage it oh you can just put um, the um, uh, conditioner uh, the conditioner and you try to massage it so that it can um, it can be uh, free um, tango free and then but all that one sorry <laughs> all that one I did it from the uh, the play uh, after doing the the excuse me after copying it with the seacomb i went straight to the dryer and i tried to wash it and then after washing it's when i have put my um conditioner and then i tried to massage for a while like five minutes and then it's when after removing it then i have blow dry just blow dry with uh no head oh just you can put a little little head yes just put a little hair and then you put right you can see how her hair is and i don't think there is any that i uh, have broke because uh, always we always consider our hairline so i'm trying to put my um oil inside yes just like that you know all these steps you do with them after washing and i hope you all know that so yeah, you just keep on doing that and when you're done you can see how it looks i'm trying to massage a little bit yes i'm trying to massage a little bit so that oh my oh it's all over yes the oil is all over so when i'm done with that i think i can hold a bath so that's why i welcome all so this is the all that i would say the um uh that moisturized spray uh, you can always do it before holding a puff yes yeah, so that your hair is safe wow i like it i like what i'm saying so please those ones who wanted to see this i think you're now comfortable and contented that extended red doesn't break your hair so for now let me sign out and see you guys in my next video remember my name is morris the crochet master and i love you so much those ones who haven't subscribed please just click on that red button and ring the bell we still have a lot a lot of things that you will need to learn yes bye bye see you guys